Hi everyone and welcome back to a new CAD Sketcher tip. On my channel there's been the question asked a number of times regarding CAD Sketcher and changing the scale of the sketch lines. So for instance, I'm going to delete this cube and come over to the CAD Sketcher and add a sketch. I'm going to go along this plane. Let's look from the Z direction and I will add some geometry in here. So I'm going to add a square. Now you can see how thick my lines are. They're very thick. Now how did I accomplish this? If you're using a Mac, you'll find these lines quite thin. There's a really easy way to solve this. If we come up, well, let's just drop that first. There we go. If we come up to edit and preferences, we go to our add-ons. Now this will be collapsed and you'll find the CAD sketcher in here. And we can type to find it if you wanted to. If we open up that, we're not looking for line thickness. We're looking for something called entity scale. So I've got my sketch on the left here, just a simple rectangle. And watch what happens if I drop this entity scale. Now what you'll probably see is an entity scale of around about one or 0 0.5. If we bring this up, our lines get thicker and it's as simple as that to change the scaling. That makes all the geometry that you add to your sketch so much easier to see. As said before, if you're using a Mac, then this is a common problem and it's easy to solve just by coming out to edit and preferences, clicking on add-ons dropping down 3D view at Sketcher and then changing the entity scale. I hope that's helped out and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. If you're enjoying these videos and you would like to support the channel, then you can do so via my Ko-Fi page. That's at ko-fi.com forward slash MJ3D Studio. Any donations will be used to help to span the channel. I'd like to thank you all for watching and I hope to see you again soon.